Hey, you're watching Juno TV. My name is Stokes, and I'm here today with... Melinda Shankar. How's it going? I'm doing great. Live right now in Degrassi. That's pretty awesome. Melinda, what are you listening to lately? What's on your playlist? You know, I've got a wide range of things going on, starting from Backstreet Boys, always have to have them in there, to Drake and J. Cole, a bunch of the cast members were all going to the concert tonight. Some Lana Del Rey, um, just a bit of everything. What was your first concert that you attended? Backstreet Boys. Wow. I have older sisters, so I just grew up listening to them, and I remember one day being in daycare, that's how long it was. <laughs> Uh, long ago it was, and my dad took the day off work, knew that I was obsessed, pulled me out of daycare, and the two of us just went to the concert together. So I think that's where my obsession came from, like all my little sentimental values that go along with that. Two questions, how obsessed were you? Still very obsessed, was very obsessed, and to the point where I did a Cribs episode and they had to feature my shrine of BSB, oh, wow. uh, which had cassettes. I have, I talk about them so much in every interview that I got surprised with spending a day with them at the Molson Amphitheater. Stalked them, <laughs> kept locks of their hair. Anyways. But what was your first CD? My first CD was Backstreet Boys as well. You yeah. were obsessed. Okay. Uh, absolutely. Uh, Favorite song? Oh, that's a the very... The one you would sing in your room? Sing them all on repeat. Yeah. I can't pick one, but uh, I think if I were to throw back their album, Black and Blue, that's my favorite. But I can't pick one song. No? Could you give us a little bit of everybody? No. Black, she's back. No, but uh, any, any helpers over there who wants to sing some Backstreet Boys? Everybody. Finish it. Yeah. That's about it. Everybody. Everybody. Finish it. Rock. Yeah. Come on, help me. Anybody? <laughs> she loves Backstreet Boys. And um, singing. Yeah. So what is your guilty music pleasure? My guilty songs would have to be, I think... You know, it's kind of funny, I'm Guyanese, and I do like some soca music, and I, that's my guilty, because people really don't expect it from me, because I'm born and raised in Ottawa, so they're like, you're Guyanese, but are you really? And I'm like, yes, I listen to soca, so that would be my guilty pleasure for music. Not a problem at all. Yeah. I work out a lot. I uh, have a black belt, and I pretty much have grown up doing lots of training with dance and that kind of stuff, so music has always been a part of it, either pumping up for fights or doing routines for a dance, that kind of, right now, working out, so... That's how it's influenced me. Back up. Fights? Uh, organized fights. My whole family, the Royal Black Belts, my dad, we opened up a school, I think in 2000, year 2000, yeah. So we all taught and that kind of thing. So we, I, my sisters are third degree black belts. I'm first degree black belts. You're on my good side, don't worry. Wow. Um, <laughs> and so I guess growing up, there's a lot of, you know, working out that has to be done, training. And sometimes to music, if it's like one of those music things. So, I mean, you always have to pick a good song to get you going. Okay. I'm going to get you to do me a favor. I want you to spell Alanis Morissette. That's because we love They it. got the easy one. <clears throat> Alanis. <laughs> A-L. You're looking at me like I'm already You wrong. could ask me to use it in a sentence if you'd like, but go ahead. Can you sing it in a song? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alanis Morissette. Google, anyone? No, no one? A-L-L-A-N-I-S, perhaps one L. Okay, you're right with the one L, go ahead. Morissette. Now for the, 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 the fun part, Morissette. M-O-R, right? I-S-S-E-T-T-E. Bingo, give her a round of applause, that was pretty good. Thank you. I, I, Thank I, I know it so well, I have to keep looking at the paper to double check if she was right. Yeah, that's what it is. Well, what is next after tweaking? Twerking, oh wow. After twer it's tweaking. <laughs> tweaking it's, it's, is next it's after this. twerking. It's just, ooh. Mm. I'm almost twerking. Twerking, What's, uh, twerking's, gonna, twerking's gonna be a lot forever. Twerking forever. <laughs> twerking forever, ever. What are the top five things you cannot live without uh, while on tour? What would you guys say are your top five things? <laughs> Coors Light. <laughs> <laughs> Coors Original, yeah, which Coors just came to Canada, by the way. Yeah. It's our favorite U.S. beer, just yeah. came to Canada.